Hey guys and welcome to Words at Scale. So Chat by Copy AI is out and up and running. So I thought it would be a good idea to compare Chat by Copy AI with Jasper Chat and see where they differ and where they are similar. So I have prepared a few questions here and there, but first I wanted to go over what Chat by Copy AI is. So basically it's a chatbot similar to that of Jasper. And right off the gate, I can see some differences like here, browse prompts. And we enter a prompt library that you can use and any prompt that you like. For example, the FAQ generator, you can press use prompt and it will auto populate. And the only thing left to do is to substitute these placeholders for the real data. So there you have it. Chat by Copy AI is generating five different FAQs and complements them with the sources, which is good. So let's clear the chat and let's start the comparison between Jasper Chat and Chat by Copy AI. I saw a few videos explaining what Chat by Copy AI is and in their tutorials they mentioned this prompt here, which is summarized the latest news on generative AI. So let's try using this prompt here. And while it's doing its thing, let's ask Ch Jasper Chat to do the same. And as you can see, it appears that Chat by Copy AI has indeed generated uh, some of the news. This one is about Einstein GBD, have no idea what that is. And included some sources, so I would, if I were to write an article around the news, I would check out all those source, sources. But uh, what you can see straight away is that they are fairly, they are very recent, so this one is March 7, March 9, March 7. So this is like a few days ago and a day ago. So this is good. So Jasper Chat is also talking about Einstein AI, but it's not in a news format. It's almost as if uh, Jasper Chat is just explaining what generative AI is. So this cannot pass for news. And I have my scoring card here ready. So I give this round to chat uh, by copy AI and Jasper chat did not do as well as I expected it to do. Now let's perform the second test, which is again based on fetch and real data. So I'll be asking chat by copy AI to summarize a specific page about coaching services. And this is a very little known page. So there are no chances of uh, copy AI's AI guessing. So it either knows the real data or it doesn't. And we'll ask the same to Jasper Chat. So I can tell you right now that this is real data uh, because I know the specific page and this is information from this intro bar here. 15 years experience is, is fetched from here. And basically this is the correct information. And we even get the uh, sources. What about Jasper Chat? Jasper Chat is making up information. Vladimir is not a business trainer and coach with over 20 years of experience. So, so this is made up data, even though we had the include source toggle on. So I would have to score this round in favor of Copy AI once again. And Jasper Chat failed miserably. But you have to understand once again that ChatGPT is spending credits even when you're using chat functionality and Jasper Chat does not. This is important budget wise. Now let's ask the two chats to write an article. So we'll use our favorite example and we'll ask chat by copy AI to write a 2000 word article about can dogs eat bananas? Bananas. And we'll try to do the same with Jasper Chat. I don't think we need to include search, so I won't. And I, I'm still wondering why this is not why this is optional. Has to be the default uh, function, in my opinion. So okay. Copy I is still writing, and Jasper Chat completed its article. And actually, 
as far as I can see, Copy AI is doing way, way better to than Jasper Chat in terms of the word count. Mm, this is interesting. This is like a full on article. Wow. And while we are waiting for Copy AI to finish, Let's just double check the word counts. The word count for Jasper was only 306 words. Let's just put it here so we don't forget it. 306. Let's check originality. This is 100% original. Let's put it here once again, 100% original. And I'm wondering what the default SEO score is. Even though this is not a fair comparison since it's only 300 words, so it doesn't contain any H2s and barely an H1. <laughs> you know, I'll have to make up an H1. Can dogs eat bananas? Dogs eat bananas. So it's not a surprise that we got a very low SEO score since the article is so little. Only 29, but still, we need to be objective. 29. And how about copy AI's article? So the word count is an astounding, <laughs> not an astounding, but it's almost 800 words. Let's check for originality. 96% original. So let's just say this war was 780 something words, doesn't matter. It was 96% original. And I'm guessing that the SEO score would be higher, 38. It's not a, a very good number but by any means, but it still beats Jasper Chat. So I would have to say that this is again won by Copy AI. So now let's uh, see if uh, both a chat by Copy AI and Jasper Chat can follow commands. And this is one of my favorite prompts for ChatGPT. And I must, I must say that Copy AI is surprising me, but it's still extremely buggy. And it's real fast actually. So it appears that. Um, I'm not sure if it understood the commands uh, to the T because like we got 20 words for each of the steps, but step four, it's uh, usually more than 20 questions because we had generated 60 questions prior. So it's safe to say that what is left is more than 20, but okay, let's see what Jasper chat is going to do again. I don't think we need to include the search. And wow, <laughs> well, I, I'll give Jasper Chat another opportunity because like it's failing me right now, even though I still love Jasper. I still think this is one of the best copywriting tools on the market as far as everything. But Jasper Chat for now, it's just it's not doing what it's supposed to. And I have to give this round to Copy AI once again. Wow, did not expect that. Now to the fun part. Let's ask both chats some factual questions. So the first factual question would be, what is the average obesity rate for America? And we'll ask Jasper Chat the same question. And I know the correct answer, so it's going to be easy to judge. Okay, this one is correct. And it's, it's given us two sources, and this one is correct also. So both Copy AI and Jasper got the information right. What about the second factual question, which is who won the Super Bowl in 2023? And again, we'll ask both Chat by Copy AI and Jasper Chat. And this answer is correct. Once again, what about Jasper chat? Wow. <laughs> Has not yet been played Jasper chat. What is wrong with you? Let's just try and ask it once again. Because I, I, I don't know what is happening with Jasper today.
it usually doesn't stab me in the back like this and it's very reliable so it guessed the no it messed up the answer once again wow well this is embarrassing jasper please watch this this is embar you're embarrassing yourselves so right now the one of the questions that i had uh, since the uh, release of uh, chat gpt turbo api is whether it means that both copy AI and jasper can do some of the tasks that chat gpt can so for that i'll use one of my favorite commands for topical clusters and let's see if both of them can generate any viable outputs okay so this is not bad but it's it's not i'll just show you how what chat gpt uh, would have done and will do in a second and as you can see this is much much more more robust not by far actually but this is still a more detailed answer what about jasper chat and jasper <laughs> wow well this is an epic fail i don't know what's happened with jasper maybe they are updating their ai as we speak but i would say that this is a b minus and this is a fail once again so all in all i i think that chat by copy AI wins almost all the rounds over jasper chat it's more accurate uh, it writes longer outputs it fetches uh, data more accurately the only downside is that it spans your credits and words whereas jasper chat does not but i really hope jasper chat get their act together and improve because this has been embarrassing and going into the experiment i expected a tie but not a decisive win for chat by copy ai and if you want to get into prompt engineering and see my favorite ChatGPT prompts, you can access my ChatGPT prompt library in the description down below. So hopefully you have found this video helpful. Like, share, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time.